Hey guys, welcome. It's week two. I have a killer grounded ab sequence for you that I think you're really gonna like. You don't need any equipment but a mat, but you can challenge with a set of ankle weights. All right, so let's get started. I'm gonna strap on my Bella bangles here. And what these are, this is not an ad, they're just really awesome ankle weights. Um, you'll see me wear them often. I like them because they don't, you know, they're, they're pretty sleek and chic and they don't um, move around at all. So they don't loosen up on you. It's like you're wearing nothing at all. They're one pound each. So I recommend anything from one pound each to one and a half. You can even go up to five. Just work up to that. Be careful. All right, guys, let's get started. I'm going to have you all lie back. So lie down on the back. And then just take one of your legs all the way up. You can release that bottom leg down or you can keep it bent and just rotate that ankle just a few times in one direction. Just let, let that back melt into your mat. Pull your leg a little bit closer. Let that opposite shoulder blade really sink down. And then once you guys are ready, just a quick stretch, ankle over knee, send those legs towards you. Let that opposite foot hang down. Spine is nice and neutral here. Keep breathing. Good, press the sacrum down just a little bit. And then once you're ready, we're gonna switch sides. So opposite leg is gonna extend. If you're tight, you can keep your bottom leg bent or let it go long. Make sure you guys are stretching. It's so super important. Go ahead, bring it a little bit closer. And then ankle's gonna go right over that opposite knee. Send those legs towards you. Spine is neutral. Sacrum's heavy, tailbone's heavy, shoulders are heavy, everything is aligned. Good, you can breathe in and out through your nose if you'd like, it's a bit of a more calming breath. Make sure when you exhale, using our breath pattern that you knit the ribs, it's not just very shallow, it's deep into the lower lobes of the lungs with the inhalation, and then exhale's a bit forceful like you're blowing out through a straw. Let's take the feet down to the floor, guys. Feet are hip width apart, legs are parallel, arms are gonna go long by your sides. Let's stay here in neutral, breathe in. And now exhale, I want you to imprint, squeeze those glutes, just start to peel up off that mat, one vertebrae at a time. I want you to center your, your weight right between your shoulder blades. Inhale and stay in this modified bridge. And now exhale, just soften that throat and your sternum. Keep your hips lifted as you roll down one vertebrae at a time. Really articulating through that spine and then right back to level neutral. We'll do it again. Inhale, shoulders wide. And now exhale, contract those abs, then the glutes, pelvic floor, start to peel, lift. Try to not let the legs go wider, keep them parallel. One long line from knee to shoulder, inhale and stay. And now exhale, just slowly. Feel like you're creating length between each vertebrae. Just like a string of pearls hitting that mat and then release it right back to neutral. All right, everybody. So I'm gonna have you lie on your left hip to start. All right, we'll be facing each other. And I'm gonna have you down on the mat here. So my body's in one long line. My head is not gonna be here. My head is gonna be down and then I'm gonna have my opposite hand, my right arm. So your right arm, this is my left, but your right is gonna be on your, uh, the back of your head here, okay? So this arm, it can be straight or it can be slightly angled. I prefer mine slightly angled. So it's totally up to you. What I want you guys to do is start long and down. Tilt the chin, make sure you're not jutting your chin forward. We're gonna breathe in. I want you to exhale, crunch up. <sighs> Inhale. <sighs> so try not to lift with your head. See this? See how I'm twisting my neck, lifting my head? That's not ab work. Try to keep your head absolutely still. <sighs> Breath. <sighs> Use the abs. Try to keep that head in line with the spine. Use your mirror, guys, reach it. So, second set, I want you to get that leg to hover. Don't let it go, don't drop it, shoulders down. If your neck bothers you, yeah, you're working it a little bit, but you're probably crooked. Keep that ear down towards your bottom arm. You're not gonna be here for long. Tilt 
Lift that chin. Exhale. Inhale. All right, guys. Final set. We're going to exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Keep on aligning that neck. If you need a little bit of assistance, bring that bottom leg forward so that you're more in like a pike position. Exhale. So legs parallel, and now it turns up lateral. All abs. When you do this twice this week, you're gonna feel the change. Isolate the core, guys. Don't let this bottom arm help you too much, and don't let the neck help you. Maintain long. Good. Final three, I know, three. Final two, you're gonna feel it in the glute as well. Outer hip and thigh, ready? Last one. All right, hold it. You can come on up now to the elbow. Rock back a little bit so that you're lifting up and out of the shoulders and up and out of the ribs. Ready guys? Lift the bottom leg to meet the top leg. So you just work that top side. Now the top side is completely isolated and you're trying not to drop that top leg. Ready? Breath. Align the head and neck. Exhale, I know. Breathe in. See if you can do it. This is a bit of a cheat, but it helps you kind of get where you need to be if you need to modify. Last two. Ready? Last set, here you go. Inhale, exhale. Shoulders down, neck is long. Breath, remember that mod I showed you. Just hold the leg up a little bit, exhale. Inhale. Final three, guys. Final two. Ready, last one. Now drop it, roll those shoulders back and down. Recover, do whatever you need to do to release that neck tension, all right? The butt is still back. I want you to crunch, split, crunch, lift. You know this. Breath. Shoulders down, exhale. Tilt that chin, drop your ear, inhale. Nothing moves from the navel up, inhale. Exhale, make sure you're curling and you're not just bringing those knees in. Crunch those abs, crunch, lift. <sighs> Try to avoid this, <sighs> where the bottom leg doesn't lift. You gotta use those obliques. <sighs> Shoulders are down. <sighs> All right, we're gonna build here. <sighs> Follow me, you're gonna hold it, lift, lower and lower. Crunch, split top leg back, lower, lift, lower, you can do it, ready, lower that bottom, lift, lower both, control, lower the bottom, lift the bottom, lower both, inhale, exhale, woo, control it, inhale, Exhale. Hold it, lift it, control the lower, crunch. Lower, inhale, exhale. Lift, lower, I cheated, last one. Ready, slowly control it, release it, woo. What I want you to do is come on up, okay? Sit back. Sit back to your right, okay? Reach to the left and just breathe in this entire top right side of your waist. All right, guys, when you're ready, we're gonna flip. We gotta do the other side. You're gonna feel this. I know you already do, but you're gonna feel it for sure. So. Swap sides. Okay. 
Now, you're gonna be on your right, okay? Body's gonna be in that one long line. You're gonna take it all the way down, maybe slightly forward with that bottom arm, okay? Top arm comes right back behind the head. Tilt the chin, remember, shoulders are depressed. You're here, reach it. You're not gonna come that high. Pull the belly in on the way down. We can go slower, then the beat. Make sure those hips are stacked. Inhale. Build that chin. Reach that leg. You're in that second set, guys. Inhale. That leg is parallel. Reach long on the release. Reach. Abs are doing the lifting. Constantly check in. Exhale. Breath. Tilt the chin. Drop that ear. All right, we're gonna build. Here we go. You're crunching. Lifting. Crunching again. Legs parallel. And now it turns lateral. Not easy. Exhale. You can do it. Itamke. This is all you, babe. This is your type. Takes a lot of focus. You need a little help. You're right here. Just don't lose the abs. See how both hands, that bottom hand came right back behind my head. Don't quit. Keep the head in line. Don't let it lift. Last three. Final two. Squeeze, lift. Last one, guys. Excellent job. Lower, you're gonna come on up to that elbow. I know. All right, so, when you're ready, that top leg is gonna lift high, all right? It's the bottom leg, you're gonna rock back. You're gonna lift the bottom. Remember that mod, inhale. Exhale. And even if you're only right here, that's fine. Don't cheat and bring your toes in. Slide those shoulders down, readjust if you need to. You can break if you need to, just like that. And then get right back into it. And it's okay if your legs don't touch. It's more important for that bottom leg to be doing all the work, the top leg is absolutely still, your abs are crunched. Ready? Last one, we're gonna add. Ready guys? You're on that hip, you're gonna crunch. So elevate those legs, crunch. Top leg goes back, crunch again, lift and split. Focus on the form here, not the speed of the beat. Shoulders down. I am not on beat, so you guys stay slow. Exhale. If this bottom hip starts to bother you, just kind of roll back a little bit. Last three. Final two. Shoulders down. It's tough. Keep them depressed. Last one. Ready, guys? Woo! We're gonna build. You're gonna lower. You're gonna lift. You're gonna lower and lower. That's your mod. It's a lower lift, lower, lower. Ready? Here we go. Crunch, split, crunch. Now, see if you can lift, lower everything with control. Inhale, exhale, 
Ready? Lower, lift, and slowly lower. Woo! Inhale, exhale. Lower, lift, and then slowly lower with control. Crunch it, split. Inhale. Bottom leg lifts and everything lowers. You see on this side, my legs aren't together. It's okay. I'm focusing on the proper muscles. Here we go. Inhale, exhale. Lower the bottom, lift the bottom, and then slowly lower with control. Inhale. Lower, lift, slowly lower. Inhale, exhale. Slowly lower and again. Inhale. Slowly lower, feel that tremble. The rectus is absolutely kicking in now. Lift, lower, final three. Inhale, exhale. Lower, lift, slowly lower. Crunch. Shoulders are down, guys. Woo, this side's hard. Last one. Lower, and slowly lower. Whoa, all right. Y'all, turn it around when you're ready. Sit back into your left. Reach towards your right or do the opposite. And breathe in. Relax the head and neck. Breathe into that waist. That's your left one. Good, guys. Switch sides if you can't feel it. Right? And now just come to your hands and knees. Ooh, great job, everybody. Hands are right underneath the shoulders. Knees are underneath of your hips. I just want you to round that back. Pull the belly in. Give it a good stretch. And now exhale. Really articulate one vertebrae at a time. Tailbone, head. Extend that spine. One more. Feel those shoulders separate. And now exhale. Slide the shoulders down. Good. Nice stretch. And then once you're ready, just straddle. Got a good stretch going on. I'm telling you, these one pounders, one pound each. They add such a challenge. Anchor that right elbow down. Reach the left arm up and give it a nice lateral stretch here. Good, guys. Just pin that left sits bone down. And then switch sides. Excellent. Pinning down that right sits bone. Stack your shoulders. Breathe in to the right side of the waist. Proud of you guys. Come on up. Woo, bring those legs together. And then reach your arms up. I want you to flex your feet. Go as low as you can. All right, if this is it, then this is it. Otherwise, come on down. Pull up on those toes. Lift the tailbone. Lift the hips. Feel that energy come right out of the crown of the head. Pull up on those toes, and I want you to do the opposite. Just release it. Let those elbows drop towards the floor. Tilt the chin. Let the belly pop, guys. Relax the knees. Good. Take one more big inhale. And exhale. Slowly roll it up. You guys are awesome. I hope you enjoy this, and you feel it. If you like this, check out laurenboji.com.